Hi friends, welcome to Mobile Feast. Today let's see how to prepare an super easy palak paneer. Quickly, let's look into the ingredients. Now let's prepare some hot water and once the water is boiled let's switch off the flame and add the palak leaves. The excess stem of the palak leaves I have removed in order to get a good texture for our gravy and let the palak cook in this hot water for 1 to 2 minutes. By doing this process, it helps us to retain the rich green color of the palak. Meanwhile, the palak is also cooked in this hot water. I have cooked the palak for 3 minutes. Let's remove into a bowl of cold water. This will stop the process of palak from further cooking. Now let's remove the excess water from the palak and add into a mixer. Here I am adding very little water as the palak itself have moisture in it. Let's grind this into a smooth paste. Now you can find the rich green color so our gravy is also going to come out very well to a pan I'm adding two tablespoons of refined oil once the oil is heated add one teaspoon of cumin seeds otherwise called jeera let it splutter one cube of butter 1 teaspoon of garlic finely chopped. The butter and the garlic is going to give the flavor to this gravy. Where the garlic should turn golden brown and infuse the garlicky flavor into the oil. 1 teaspoon of ginger finely chopped. 1 teaspoon green chili finely chopped. 1 medium size onion finely chopped. Once the onion turns transparent, let's start adding the masala powders. Half teaspoon coriander powder, half teaspoon of garam masala, one fourth teaspoon of Kashmiri chili powder, now let's add the grinded mixture. Now let's add the paneer cubes. If you want you can toss the paneer in butter and then add into this mixture but I personally feel the juicy paneer with this palak makes a very good combination. Now let's close the lid and cook for 2 minutes and needn't cook too much as the palak is already cooked. Now let's add 1 teaspoon of fresh cream. Let's switch off the stove as the cream needn't boil. Friends, you should definitely try this recipe. It's very nutritious and really yummy. Hope you like this recipe. Please do try this recipe for such easy recipes do visit my channel and if you are new to my channel kindly subscribe and click the bell icon to receive the future notification if you like this recipe kindly share with your friends and family members and leave your valuable comments in the comment section below thank you